guys, back here again with another video, um, we're sitting in the kitchen right now, cause, you know, better lighting, and, I don't know, I just, I like it, I don't know why, but I like being this close to the camera, I can rest in my room when I'm close to the camera, but I'm close to the camera, not like I'm close enough, if that makes any sense, but yeah guys, um, I already got my, I already got me dip in some Long coat winter green. So guys, I can't pack the dip. You should probably go ahead and do that if you dip. If you don't, it's whatever. But yeah, guys, today we're gonna talk about the NBL. Of course, NBL stands for you know Major League Baseball. Everyone knows that shit. They have been dip, and I will get into it. So. Let's pull up the little news article. Oh, why don't we? It's got a load. Uh, as as y'all know, dip and sports go hand in hand. Like there's a bunch of NFL players that dip. A bunch of you know. A bunch of NFL players that have a bunch of NHL players that that's hockey. Uh, you know, cause I guess I guess Dip's a stress reliever. Or I mean, if you do sports, I guess I don't know, but you know, it's it's been really popular in baseball since fucking a long ass time. Like ever since they started started up baseball, like you'll always find it different no matter what. But it says here. Um, and by the way, guys, I didn't steal this off of my jug one or Chris Tips one or any of them because they did a video on this, but I'm doing my own little video on it. Because you know why not? Because, yeah. Uh, it says right here the Wednesday night that the Major League Baseball Association they reached a verbal agreement. And it will cover the next five years. And. And the CBA. I guess the CBA is. I don't know what it is. But. Uh, that it was their decision to ban chewing tobacco. And. It, it's kind of weird because. You know. Like. Uh, it they just banned it for the rookies, like, because apparently they say that, like, the players that already dip or whatever, like, that's been on the team forever or grandfathered in to the sport, so they can dip tobacco and get away with it, but rookies can't dip tobacco, and fans also can't dip tobacco, like, in the stadiums, like, it's like a, uh, let me find it. Well, anyways, guys, but yeah, fans can't dip tobacco in the stadiums. Like, you'll get a fine. I'm not sure what it is. I think it's like two hundred and $250, something like that. Some crazy ass shit. But, and I think it's kind of funny because, you know, the reason they banned uh, dipping tobacco in baseball for the rookies is because, uh, Tony Gwynn, uh, he was a famous baseball player. He was a black baseball player. He played for, shit, I forgot who he played for, but he, he, uh, you know, I don't feel like fucking searching it up, what team he played for, but he, but he played baseball professionally for a bunch of years, and he got, a. Uh, salivary gland cancer and if you don't know that's you know cancer in your salivary glands and it's not proof from dipping like I mean it's not it's not proved to be from dipping um like it could be you can get cancer you can get salivary gland cancer from fucking anything you can get cancer from anything these days dude fucking going out in the sun you can get skin cancer eating raw food you can get fucking you know just so, it's not, 
it, it, it wasn't proven from tobacco products or smoke of tobacco. And uh, Tony Gwynn's family actually is suing the tobacco companies over it, thinking it's over dip because, you know, he dipped fucking a lot of years and shit. I mean, it could be over dip, it couldn't be, you know, who knows. My opinion, my opinion on it is it possibly could be because, you know, he dipped. But, I'm, I mean, you know, whatever. Uh, but, yeah, I think it's kind of crazy how they're banning uh, tobacco and shit in stadiums. And, you know, they sell, they sell alcohol at the stadiums because the reason they, another reason they ban smokeless tobacco products in stadiums or for and from players is because young kids, you know, look up to the look up to their favorite players or whatever, and if they're dipping, it, you know, they might get hooked onto it or some shit. But then again, it goes hand in hand with uh, like alcohol, because you know they sell alcohol at the stadiums, beer, whatever, and you know. Your kids are around that, so what's the difference with, you know, smokeless tobacco and shit? And, you know, there's fights and stuff, and, you know, kids see that, you know? You know what, what fucking gives, dude? It's stupid. But anyways, let's read, let's read on the article some more. Uh, it says... It says, right here, of course, okay, Tony Gwynn played for the San Andreas, San Diego Padres, and it says he died to sever Gwynn cancer, and Gwynn's family, uh, they filed a lawsuit earlier this year against the tobacco companies, and they... Hang on. You know, Tony Green did for 31 years, so, you know, it's kind of... If it was from tobacco, it was going to happen sooner or later, but, you know, about that crap. You know, there's more people getting cancer and dying from freaking smoking cigarettes than there's freaking smokeless tobacco. It's fucking crazy shit. But yeah, guys, uh, that's my little fucking run on that. I hope you like that shit. Uh, I want to think of some more shit to do. Some more uh, topics to do. So if you have a topic you want me to discuss or whatever about, you know, whatever, I, you know, hell, I'll discuss it. As long as it's not too personal, like if it's a story or what, well, hell, I'll do stories about, you know, whatever. I just won't say people's names because I already got my ass chewed out for that once by my, by my ex. <laughs> but, you know, guys, besides that shit, uh, you know, as always, you know, take it easy. You take it twice. And my shout outs are TXM Whiskey, of course, Just Chew Man. Uh, I don't know if Percy should watch my videos, but as y'all know, I said in my last videos, he just doesn't do videos no more, but you know. Uh, my new subscribers, you know, the dips and shit, you know, the dips. Uh, I will put a link to William's channel in the description and the dips channel. And... You know, anybody I go shout out to, I'll put, if they're still active, I will put their link, I'll put their link to their YouTube channel in the description. Um, alright guys, well, I hope you liked this video, and, you know, you know as always guys, keep it southern, and I will catch y'all in the next video.